welcome to s dot med guru classes now our discussion is homogeneous differential equation homogeneous differential equation we solve some problems now we consider some problems which are not homogeneous but we convert to homogeneous so homogeneous means if all the terms their degrees are same this is homogeneous differential equation now if we get this equation dy dx equal to ax plus by plus c capital a capital b y plus c capital c if we get this type of equation this is not homogeneous because the x of degree of x is 1 y is 1 but here x y not given here also x y not only constant term given if constant term given then this is not homogeneous differential equation now we convert to homogeneous differential equation case 1 we consider a by a b by b this is a by a b by b form the equation of the form dy dx equal to ax plus by plus c ax plus by plus c can be reduced to homogeneous form by the substitution method. By the substitution method, we can by substitution we can convert in homogeneous form if a by a b by b we have. So we consider this for solving this problem, we putting x equal to capital X plus H, y equal to capital Y plus K, where H, K are constants, H, K are constants. Now, dx equal to we get d capital X, this is constant 0 and dy equal to this is d capital y k is constant 0 now we have dy dx equal to dy dx dy dx equal to capital dy capital uh, small d capital y small d capital x we get this now, if we putting this value here in this equation, now suppose this is equation number 1. Now, 1 implies, 1 implies dy dx we can write d capital Y, d capital X. And this is a x we putting x plus s and b y we putting capital Y plus K plus e small c and this will be capital A X means capital X plus is capital B Y means capital Y plus K plus C we get this one. So this will be dy dx this is a capital x plus a s b y plus b k plus a small c and this is a capital a capital x capital a small s this into this this into this plus b capital y capital b capital y uh, plus b k plus b k plus capital C this one we get now this will be d y d x this is a x plus b y this one a s plus b k plus c ax plus by plus as as plus bk plus c we get this now let us choose h and k in such a way that this term and this term is zero so we consider we choose
we choose we choose hk so that we choose h and k in such a way that such a way that then a is plus b k plus c k to zero capital a small s capital b small k plus capital c equal to zero we choose h and k in such a way that then this term and this term will be zero. By solving these two, we get values of H and K and that equation becomes, therefore, this equation will be dy, this is AX plus BY plus capital A, capital X, capital B, capital Y. So this is both are capital, all of this capital, capital X, Y, capital X, Y, capital, this is capital A, capital B. And this equation becomes homogeneous. This is obviously homogeneous. So X, X degree 1, Y degree 1, this is 1, 1. So they are all the terms, the degrees are same. So this is homogeneous differential equation. We can easily solve by putting Y equal to VX. By putting Y equal to VX, we can easily solve. So this is our first condition. If the equation in the form of A by A, B by B plus B by B form, this form, then we convert this equation in homogeneous form by putting x equal to x plus s and y equal to small y equal to capital Y plus k. And by substitution in this way, we get the equation homogeneous. And putting y equal to b x, we can easily solve this problem. This is the first rule case 2 if a by a b by b then coefficient of x in numerator and coefficient of x in denominator coefficient of x in numerator y in numerator coefficient of y in denominator if these two are equal then the value of h k will not be finite will not be finite so we consider a by capital A equal to B by capital B equal to 1 by M say. So in this case we get uh, we get A equal to capital A equal to AM capital B equal to BM. Therefore the equation becomes dy dx equal to AX plus BY plus C by capital AX plus capital B small y capital C. This equation becomes AX plus BY plus C. A means we consider AM. B means we consider BM plus C capital C. So in this case, we get ax plus by plus c from this to m common ax plus by plus c so in this case ax plus by ax plus by is common factor common term in numerator and denominator so we putting putting uh, ax plus by equal to z and we substitute we get our required answer this is the rule so first rule already given and second rule if coefficient of x coefficient of x numerator denominator coefficient of y coefficient of y their ratios are equal then we consider in this method and in this case we get the record solution of the homogeneous differential equation now let us consider, consider on this problem. problem solve dy dx equal to x plus 2y minus 3 twice x plus y minus 3 this is not homogeneous because here degree 1, degree 1, here x, y not given, degree is 0. Uh, degree 1, 1, this is not given, degree is 0. So, this is not homogeneous. Now, we convert the equation in homogeneous form, but this one, coefficient of x, 1, this is 1, this is 2, and this is 2, this is 1. These two are not equal. That means, uh, a by a, b by b form uh, b by b form 
so i putting we convert this problem in homogeneous form solution so putting x equal to capital x plus h y equal to capital y plus k so we get dx equal to dx dy equal to dy and h k are constant so the therefore we get dy dx equal to dy d x d capital y d capital x so we get this now this equation we have in this equation if you putting dy dx this equal to x x means x plus is y means y plus k minus 3 and this is 2 x plus is y y plus k minus 3 this is x plus 2 y plus h plus twice k minus 3 twice x plus y plus 2 h plus k minus 3 we get this this x plus 2 y 2 k we write 2 y is first and this is 2 x 2 a is then 2 x first this y 2 a is k minus 3 here so we get this this is number 1 we consider this is dy dx let us choose h and k in such a way that this term and this term will be 0 such a way that h plus 2k minus 3 equal to 0 2h plus k minus 3 equal to 0 this is number 2 this is number 3 we get we get 2 3 now we solving this two equation any method so this is h if we multiplying by 2 then we get 2h 2h to subtracting get cancel or any method cross multiplication substitution method any method we can consider then we can easily find a s and k so we consider 2 into 2 equation number 2 multiplying by 2 we get 2 a s plus 4 k minus 6 equal to 0 so we get this this is number 4 we consider now 1 minus 4 2 minus 4 this is equation number 2 this is 4 if we subtract this not 2 3 minus 4 we get 3 minus 4 this minus this 2 is 2 is cancel k minus 4 k we get minus 3 k and minus 3 this minus is 6 then we get plus 3 this equal is 0 and obviously k equal to 1 the value of k what putting the value of k in equation number 2 2 implies h plus 2 into 1 minus 3 this equal to 0 h minus 1 equal to 0 and h equal to 1 therefore k equal to 1 h equal to h equal to 1 k equal to 1 we get the two constants now this ultimately is 0 then we get this now 1 implies if you putting h and k 1 1 then this term 0 this term 0 so now 1 implies we get dy dx equal to x plus 2y 2x plus y we get this now obviously this is homogeneous very easy this homogeneous now we solve this let 
कैपिटल वाई इक्वल टू भी कैपिटल एक्स डी वाई डी एक्स दिस इज भी प्लस एक्स डी भी डी एक्स वी गेट दिस इफ यू पुटिंग दिस वैल्यू हियर देर फोर वी गेट भी एक्स एक्स डी भी डी एक्स and this is x means vx uh, x is x y means vx this is twice x plus vx this so this implies v x dv dx equal to x common we get 1 plus 2v by x common 2 plus v, x x cancel, x d v d x, 1 plus 2 v, 2 plus v minus v. This v taking left hand side, right hand side. And 2 plus v, 1 plus twice v, taking LCM, twice v minus v square. So this is 2 plus v. 2v 2v cancel 1 minus v square this is x dv dx and this one dividing this side 2 plus v 1 minus v square dv this is dx by x so you get this now variable separation is complete dv dv with v dx with x now integrate both sides we get this is 2 uh 1 by 1 minus v square this one plus v by 1 minus v square dv equal to log capital x we get this one So we know this is direct formula one by one minus v square. This can be written as two one by two log one plus v by one minus v. We can write this one minus one by v square means one by two log this, and this is ah uh, one by two. and this power difference one this power two this power one uh, power two power one two minus one one if power difference is one two minus one one then we differentiate denominator putting the result in numerator so if we differentiate denominator then we get minus twice v by one minus v square dv and this is log of capital x this one so actually here plus v but we get minus 2 we taking minus 1 by 2 outside then this will be same line we get this 2 to cancel or we can write 2 by 2 log 1 plus v by ah uh, 2 to cancel directly 1 minus v and minus 1 by 2 this is log 1 minus v square this is log x and plus c1 you consider so here using the formula this formula this formula is we know this formula dx by a square minus x square equal to 1 by twice a log of a plus x by a minus x plus c so this formula if you putting a equal to 1 1 1 1 we get this one and this one using this formula integration f dash x by f x dx this is log of denominator 
if we differentiate f x we get f dash x if differentiation of denominator given in numerator answer log of denominator this differentiation of denominator given in numerator then answer log of denominator so in logarithm this is divide division given we can write log 1 plus v minus log 1 minus v and this is log 1 plus v into 1 minus v this is log of capital x plus c1 now in this problem 1 by 2 log in logarithm division means we write minus log m minus log n this is 1 plus v minus log 1 minus v this is minus in logarithm it's into given we write plus in front of bracket minus so we get log 1 plus v minus 1 by 2 log 1 minus v equal to log x plus c1 so we get this now uh, this will be uh, log this and this we get 1 by 2 log 1 plus v this and this minus 1 minus 1 by 2 minus 3 by 2 log 1 minus v log x plus c1 we get this multiplying both side by 2 then we get log 1 plus v minus 3 log 1 minus v this is 2 log x 2 c1 we get this so this will be log 1 plus v log 1 minus v whole cube this is log x square we consider log c since we know this formula n log m equal to log m to the power n n log m we write log m to the power n so this is 3 log this we write power this is 2 log this we write power and 2 c equal to where 2 c 1 equal to log c we get so again you know if log m minus log n then this is log m by n so we get this formula in logarithmic minus given we write division this is minus we write division so this will be log of 1 plus v by 1 minus v whole cube we get this this equal to so here plus given also we know this formula log m plus log n this is log of m n so this is log m log n log of m n this is log x square into c so log log cancel 1 plus v 1 minus v whole cube c x square but we consider y equal to v x then v equal to y by x we replacing this so we get uh, v equal to y by x y by x whole cube this is c x square and lcm is x x plus y by x and here we get x minus y whole cube by x cube we get this so x minus y by x this whole cube by whole cube this this is c x square now this one becomes in numerator this implies 
x plus y by x into x cube into x cube by x minus y whole cube equal to c x square. This cancel x square we get and this is also cancel. So, we get x plus y by x minus y whole cube this is c and this one multiplying on right hand side we get x minus y whole cube. But actually small x means capital X plus a c we consider and small y means capital Y plus k we consider we know starting we consider at the very beginning we consider x equal to x plus is and y equal to y plus k and already after solving we get a c equal to 1 and k equal to 1 this is a c equal to 1 k equal to 1 and capital x equal to x minus 1 capital y equal to small y minus 1 y taking one taking left hand side we get this now putting this value in the equation this therefore we get x equal to x minus 1 y equal to y minus 1 c x minus 1 and y equal to y minus 1 this and this will be x plus y minus 2 c c x minus y this will be plus 1 then this is cancel we get this one and this is our final answer this is the required solution x plus y minus 2 equal to c into x minus y whole cube the solution is lengthy but not difficult and these are important if not homogeneous we convert to homogeneous and solve as usual method in homogeneous method and this is the final answer x plus y minus 2 equal to c into x minus y whole cube this is our answer if you are enjoying with me then please like this video if you are new in my channel then please subscribe my channel and click the bell icon thank you